Man, y'all should ban the Super Bowl. <laughs> ban the Super Bowl. Don't watch that weak ass shit, man. And I don't think too many people gonna watch it no way. I think it's just gonna be the the fans, the super fans of Kansas City and and, and, and super fans of San Francisco. But that shit gonna be trash. Who want to see them two teams in the Super Bowl right now? You know, like I would have, I would have watched the um, Sam. Even though I ain't even been in the San Fran man with Purdy and them, I was happy they beat Dallas like any time. But I ain't been into that team, man. Them niggas lame. Like they ain't even no geek squad like that. Like they ain't geeked up. They. It kind of goofy, man. That's one of the, the lamest San Fran squads I've ever seen in my life. You know, I ain't into them, man. They ain't got no star power or nothing. Like, don't nobody stand out pretty all little and weak. They they just, they ain't geek, man. Like, like Steve Young, them, uh, Joe Montana, them, you know, even Kaepernick, them. You know, they these, these dudes look lame. And I'm my home and them. I'm tired of them, man. I'm tired of weak ass chief jerseys. <laughs> my home, he just looks so goofy, man. Oh man, then they got this Taylor Swift lady. That's what this is all about. Like, you know, why would it? Why is she popular? I don't know. Not one Taylor Swift song. Maybe you know that that ain't for me though. That ain't my genre of music. So I I shouldn't know, but. <laughs> ban this Super Bowl, man. Don't watch it just because it's football. Man, nobody going for neither one of these teams for real, man. It would have been a better Super Bowl how it was supposed to be because both of them teams was better than the teams they played. The Lions was is better. They got more better players and everything than San Francisco. And, and come on, Baltimore is most definitely better than Kansas City, man. Lamar Jackson, they paid Lamar Jackson, and they paid that team, told them to, you know, lose that game for a reason. I don't know why, but it was a certain reason. But come on, with, with Lamar Jackson and, and, and the way the Lions fans behind the Lions, that Super Bowl, oh, man, that would have been out cold. Like, that, that Super Bowl would have been fire. They try to act like people, you know, it went to so man, that would have one thing about Detroit fans, if Detroit would have went, oh, that would have man, if the if the Lions would have went to the Super Bowl, Detroit people would have flooded Vegas. Cause they flooded anyway. Niggas flood Vegas anyway, or just on a regular day. Detroit niggas stay out of there in Vegas. I know that from when I used to be on social media. Them niggas was out in Vegas every day. <laughs> For the Super Bowl, man, Detroit would have flooded Vegas. I don't know about Baltimore people, but Detroit would have flooded it by itself. You know, we ain't never been in no shit like that, no Super Bowl, man. Them niggas would have towed Vegas up. <laughs> That's probably why they ain't want it. They know the Detroit niggas would have acted a ducky out there in Vegas. You know, niggas here get money. Moolah, baby. <laughs> it's street millionaires, all type of things, just in the black community. And then you know the the, the white people would have been there, the white fans. Man, they would have went to Russia for the Super Bowl for, <laughs> for the Lions, man. The Lions fans, the white boys, man, they would have went all the way to Russia to see that shit. The NFL dropped the ball on this one, man. They rigged it and left out the two good teams. Left out their brother, Lamar Jackson. Left him out, man. I don't know what that was about. But who know? Who the, who want to see Kansas City, man? <laughs> I want to see Kansas City, man. And who want to see the Niners, man? Nobody like the Niners, but real Niners fans. Not, Niners is not a popular team, bro. But since they out there, I guess they feel like the San Fran is easier for them to come out there. I don't know why they rigged it, but them both of them games rigged. Like I said, Lamar Jackson, he wasn't Lamar. The Lamar wasn't Lamar in that game. He, he, he wasn't doing what he do. I watched him take sacks. I seen that dude fumble on the um in the end zone on purpose and 
all type of stuff, man. I seen a lot of blown calls with the, the rest one call. You know, it was just, it was, it was a stage. And then with the Lions, come on, Dan Campbell, man. Once I seen, I was yelling at the TV like, kick it, kick it. I told him in the first in the first half when he almost ain't want to kick the field goal, kick the field goal, kick it. And then when that second time he ain't do it, and they, oh, I'm like, oh, no, this rig, man. And when, once I seen he ain't kicked that field goal when it was 24 to 10, I'm like, this rig. I said it then. I'm like, this rig, man. They, the Lions going to lose. And then when we the, the San Fran went, went um, when Gibbs fumbled on the first down, I'm like, oh, come on, this rig. I turned the game off. I ain't even watched the rest. I'm like, man, I started watching Home Improvement. <laughs> I'm like, this this rig, dog. This rig, man. Because ain't no way they going to – oh, when dude, dude dropped that – on that – for when he dropped that – um past that Reynolds dude that went to the side smiling and laughing you know uh, trying to be cute that light skin nigga shit man in real life boy I seen real football games when a dude drop a pass they supposed to I had seen them niggas get on their ass like Ray Lewis and all them type of niggas back when football used to be real man let a nigga would have dropped the ball for the Ravens and, and, and came back smiling but Ray Lewis would have ate that boy we would have dug this motherfucker chest. <laughs> like the general said, he be saying, he would have dug in his chest. <laughs> and then he would have dug in that boy chest. You know, Runners come over there smiling, then Campbell slap him on the back, giving him fans and shit. Man, that shit was rigged, man. Yo, hey, I'm not watching the Super Bowl. I'm making sure that shit ain't on none of my TVs in here. Now, and I was going to throw a Super Bowl party this year. That shit canceled, man. I'm spending that money on my uh, holy day, man. I'm going to have a good holy day with my kids, man, in a couple months or something, man. I ain't about to waste that money, buying all that food, watch that weak-ass shit, man. Fuck San Fran and KC, man. Fuck the NFL, dog. You know, they, they done lost me, man. I don't care, man. Only way I watch the NFL again if the San, if um, Lions go to the Super Bowl next year, <laughs> then I might tune into that. But I'm not even watching the regular season, dog. Cause that shit's some bullshit, man. That's rigged. Everybody know this rig. Every everybody, I just keep scrolling down on YouTube. Everybody know that shit was rigged. Both of them games. And Jake the a hole called it a week ago. And when I seen him make that video, man, I I didn't even want to watch them games. I'm like, this is too true, man. He done called out too many situations that make sense. You know, with the Taylor Swift and all that. And I've been seeing miss blocks and miss um, tackles all year. I'm like, man, how they miss that tackle, man? These dudes are professionals. This ain't no high school. This ain't college. These the top of the tops. You not dropping no open pass, you know, in no playoff championship game, and you a professional, and you smiling after that? Man, you about to slam your helmet. You about to kick shit. You going to be mad at yourself. Man, if it's real, fire Dan Campbell. Dan Campbell not a player on the field. The players on the field good because the Lions been losing a lot of seasons, so they got a lot of players through the draft. Fire Dan Campbell, bro. That'll show me his shit real. Because he blew the game. And that, that's because it was rigged. That's why they're going to keep him, man. Dan Campbell led the team. He ain't led nothing, man. Because we could have had more wins than that. He was blowing shit. So if I was y'all, I wouldn't watch that Super Bowl. I don't think too many people going to watch it anyway. People going to watch it just because they programmed to watch it. Like, Want to see the halftime show? Who want to see Usher, man? Uh, Usher, Usher, or no, um, um, homo, man. Who want to watch that, man? I'm not watching none of that. I don't care about no halftime show. I don't care about none of them commercials. None of that. I ain't watched the last shit four, five Super Bowls. I can't remember the last Super Bowl I watched, man. I don't even know who was playing in it. <laughs> so. Uh, Man, I'm through with this year, man. But this was rigged. People shouldn't even watch it, man. 
especially Detroit fans. Lions fans do not watch that shit, man. Make this be a all time low watch Super Bowl so they can stop rigging shit. Let the real players go because I guarantee you, if it was Baltimore Lions in that shit, oh, it would have been live. Plus, the Lions owe them anyway for how Baltimore smacked them up earlier this year. Oh, that would have been a good Super Bowl, man. I would have had the party of the year. <laughs> but nah, I ain't even watching that junk, man. I'm about to end this video right now, but y'all should y'all should ban the Super Bowl, man. Don't watch it, man. Real Lions fan. Any NFL fans, they playing y'all, dog. It's scripted. They playing y'all. Don't watch that bull crap, man. Ban the Super Bowl.